the road toward a virtual performance of any kind of quality is rather complex. Allow me to describe our process from last semester. First, I created a video of myself conducting the piece completely in my head. I sent that video to our extraordinary pianist, Dr. Hiroyo Hatsuyama, who watched the video of me conducting and recorded herself playing the accompaniment and or vocal parts. She then sent her audio back to me and I added her audio to my conducting video in Final Cut Pro software. I then sent that video to my talented choral student workers who watched the video with the piano audio and recorded their own soprano, alto, tenor, or bass part. They each sent me their audio recordings and I added their SATB parts to the audio mix, thereby completing what we called the template video. In the meantime, the choir met via Zoom each week where we went over diction, dynamics, phrasing, expression, and other musical elements in the abstract. Dr. Hatsuyama joined us and played through the parts on the piano in the Zoom meetings. At a particular date, the students had a submission deadline by which they needed to have dressed up in their performance attire and recorded themselves singing while watching the template video and listening to the audio through headphones. They submitted these video recordings to a Google Drive folder and I separated the audio from the video and mixed and mastered the 38 vocal parts using Logic Pro software. Since the singers were recording in various acoustical spaces such as bedrooms, garages, bathrooms, closets, or wherever they could find, I added some reverb effects to make it sound like we were singing together in a concert hall. Our video production folks, the amazing Danielle Labello and Holly Jackson, took all the individual student videos and created the cool visual effects, being sure to sync the videos up with my audio mix. After this was all done, we had effectively created one single song. <laughs> Over the course of the first eight weeks of the semester, we worked on a total of seven songs, which was quite a challenge given the complicated nature of the process. And this is how many choirs across the country have managed to continue to meet and make music. <laughs> 